Well, hello, welcome to Izzy's Tarot. Thank you for coming to my channel. You could have been anywhere, but you came to my channel for that. I'm extremely grateful. Thank you so much. I'm going to do a Libra love prediction reading for December 27th. Happy birthday to me. To January 2nd. Happy New Year to you. Please keep in mind this is a general read. If it's not your story, it's not your story. Don't try to make it your story. Just take what you can from it and leave the rest. In addition, please know that energy, energy can go either way. It can be your energy, your significant other's energy, or someone else that's in your love space. Keep that in mind as you watch and as you listen. If you enjoy my reading, please give me a subscription or a like. I will be most humbled, most honored, and always very grateful if you decide to do that. Thank you in advance if you do. Also, please know the first five cards that I laid down are a general overview. The second part of the reading is your reading is where I clarify the cards so that you can get the true uh, story that the spirit guides want you to know. So if this is your reading, sit back, relax, and listen to the entire reading. Let's see what's going on with my lovable, kind, loyal, sweet Libras. Show me what's going on with my Libra spirit guides. Show me what's going on with my Libras. Show me spirit guides. What's going on with my Libras? What you got going on, Libras? Let's see. The devil, the hanged man, the two of wands, the world, and the page of swords. Libra, I'm going to tell you what I see here, which is really interesting. You lead up the card with the devil. The devil is a Capricorn card, but more importantly, it's a card of addiction. It's a card of lust. It's a card of, um, hmm, it's, it's, it's also, um, let me say this sometimes, and I always say this devil gets a bad rap sometimes because I also believe that me, it means that you're incredibly in love with someone because to be in love with someone, you have to be addicted to their energy and you are addicted to this energy. Whoever this person is, you are, um, hmm, you can't shake this addiction. You can't shake this addiction no matter what they do. You're trying very, very hard to shake an addiction to someone. To shake an addiction to someone. Something about them, whatever they give you, it makes you addicted to them. You cannot leave them. Um, and you're stuck. You see this, this hangman here next to this devil? That means that you are just stuck right there in that addiction. You don't know what to do because you don't understand why you can't leave this addiction to them. But then you have the two of wands that's in the middle of your reading. And the two of wands is all about progressing, progression. And progression means that you are slowly but surely, I do believe, trying to come out of this. Trying to come out of this. This is something that's had you for quite some time. You've been bound by this. You've been leading your life by somebody that you are addicted to. But this two of wands means that you're slowly but surely looking toward the future and making progressive, being progressive, doing progressive things to get you out of this addiction that you are stuck to. But here's, look what happened. Here's the world. And to me, and the world is completion. And what I want to tell you is that I do believe that you are completing an addiction to someone. You are completing an addiction to someone. But it's really just not that easy, is it, Libra? Because, you know, when we um, move away from someone or break up with someone, we, don't, we want closure. We want closure or they want closure. And you are trying to give this person closure. But see, here's the thing. I'm not quite sure. If you're done with this yet, because you have this page of swords there and this addiction is like one of those things where, you know, you say you're done, but you're really not done. Even though you say you completed, you're done, you're over it, it no matter what. <clears throat> but this um, page of swords is all about communication. It's all about communication. Are you trying to get closure? Are they trying to get, I don't know. But the page of swords means that you communicate no matter what. Um... Maybe you're the one that's saying, um, I'm done with it and they're coming back. I don't know. But there's a strong communication still going on with you guys. Even though there's a completion of a cycle. There's a completion of a cycle here. What is this cycle? Did you come? What is this cycle? Um, uh, 
Are they addicted to I don't know. I'm going to keep reading and try to find out. But there is strong communication with that Page of Swords still there. That Page of Swords is all about communication. The Page of Swords is um, communication, Facebook, Instagram, voicemail, text messages. It doesn't matter. It is all about communication to someone that you are addicted to and that you're trying to complete a cycle with. Um, hmm. Let's see. Let's see. If this is your read, sit back, relax, and let me see about your addiction to someone. Show me, spirit guys. Why is this devil here? Show me why the devil is here. Show me, spirit guys. Uh, you have the five of swords. The five of swords. Whoever I'm reading for, you're all in your head about this addiction. You can't let this addiction go, but this is something, hey, this is all over you. This five of swords, is, you're fighting in your head. It's conflict. But it's in your head. It's all in your head. It's conflict. But it's all in your head. It's, and you know what that means? It means that they're not making you hold on. It's in you. You can't let go. This five of swords is conflict in your head. It's all in your head. It's all in your mind game. It's all in your mind. Not a game, but all in your mind. So let's see why the hangman is here. Why is the hangman here? Show me spirit, guys. Why is the hangman here? Show me spirit, guys. King of Swords. Look at all these swords coming out. King of Swords is a very practical card. It's um, a very a card that's, that's saying um, it's either yes or no. No gray matter. Um, very practical. Uh, tell you like it is. Not afraid to speak their truth. Um, this is all about truth. And perhaps with this hanged man here, you know the truth. Um, and, and the truth, I think that you really know what you need to do. Or you really know that you are addicted to this person, but you can't let go. And you're trying to figure out the truth. You're trying to figure out what do I do to release this addiction? <clears throat> what do I do to release this addiction? So let's see why the two of wands is here. Show me why the two of wands is here. Show me spirit guys. Why is the two of wands here? Three of Wands. Okay. So now you are looking toward the future. You are desperately getting out of this. You're trying to get out of this because you're looking toward the future with this person or without this person, one way or the other. But that Three of Wands means you're looking toward the future. So you got Two of Wands here. You see how you begin the process here? You Well, it's not the beginning of the process, but it's in between the process. It's the... It's the um, Doing the process, and here's where the Three of Wands, where you're looking into the future with the process. You're taking actionable steps to get away from this addiction. You're taking actionable steps. So let's see. Why is the world card here? Show me, Spirit Guides. Why is the world card here? Yep. The world card, and you have the Eight of Cups. Thank you, Spirit Guys. Thank you for um, telling me that I'm reading just what you want me to know. You are moving away from this addiction finally. Finally. Get, you're getting out your head. You know the truth. This person, I don't believe, uh, wants to be with you like you want to be with them. So you're walking away. Now, this is what I have so far. You're walking away. This says the world says the cycle is complete and you're walking away. So let's see why the Page of Swords is here, though. Show me why the Page of Swords is here. Show me, Spirit Guys. Why is the Page of Swords here? Yeah, man. Somebody's angry. See that tower there? That tower means all hell's... Oops, excuse me. I hope you too... All heck is broke loose. You walked away from someone and all heck is broke loose. How dare you, they say. This is all about anger. The you, you, good for you, um, Libra. You ended a cycle. You walked away. And then you have um, people are communicating with you, but it's angry communication because they thought you'd never do it. They thought they had you, didn't they? They thought they had you, Libra, but they didn't. They didn't. You finally got the strength to walk away. Then let's start to begin the devil card. This is about an addiction to someone. You can't leave them alone no matter what. You, they, you let them. They've done some horrible things, I think. And, and, I, and I say that with all with my heart. I think that they've been very horrible to you. They've not been good to you, but something about them keeps you tied to them. I don't know this five of spirits there, the five of swords, and it's all in your head. But then you have the hangman where you're stuck. 
You're stuck in a situation. You're stuck in a situation. This situation. But here's this king. Oh, king of swords coming at that energy. That um, tell all energy. That you know that you know that you know energy. That practical energy that's telling you, you, be, you better wake up, dummy. Then you got the two of wands here with the three of wands. Two of wands is the beginning of a cycle of the completion. And three of wands is taking actual steps. Which right here in the world, you complete this. You walk away. Then you have communication and the tower here. Angry communication. They are angry. Trust me, they are angry, angry. How dare you walk away from them? So let's see what my queen, African queen goddesses have to say. Show me. What do my queen goddesses have to say? Oh, Medusa. Rage. They have rage, honey, because that tower means all hell is breaking loose and it's, it's, all I see is anger with you. They want to start messing with you, anger with you. But you walked away from this. This is what I have from you, Libra, for your love prediction reading. 